Well, Jeep, it was nice meeting you. you Thanks too, for coming. Dude. Hope to meet up soon. Yeah, absolutely. And then maybe you'll have better tires by then, but... <laughs> absolutely. Y'all, I will be getting tires from my Jeep. Yeah, he's going to get the, the KO2s, right? <laughs> maybe. He's like, look, these things are balding over here. Dude, get out of here. <laughs> <laughs> We've been harassing him the whole time. <laughs> so he, he, did, he did teach me and my dad how to, like, you know, keep our bodies in shape and stuff just by, like, what would it take? Maybe 20 minutes? Yeah, like yeah, a 20, 20 like a 20 minute workout. It was a full body workout. Full body workout. So I'll have to like write down a list though, like 20 squats, 20 push ups, something like that. I don't remember more than that, but like I'll send it to you. He'll send it. He'll yeah. send it to me. He's got like the full list. So 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 you see him now. He's gonna be completely different. I'm gonna be like in this. two weeks. I'm gonna be built two weeks. In two weeks. Really? Well, not really, but uh, <laughs> maybe two weeks. I'll, I'll start <laughs> looking different. No, no, not two weeks. Yeah. Okay. Well, what, what's the minimum time? I have to do this every day. Uh, three months. Three months, I'm going months. to be built. Let's, let, yeah, let's. I just be want to be realistic. lean. Yeah, three, okay. months, three months. Realistic. Yeah. realistic. But he said I can still eat pizza as long as I do this. Sometimes. Sort of. Yeah. Sort of. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm sorry. sorry. We <laughs> all are. Well, have some trip, man. Yeah. Good to meet okay, you. Thank you. Appreciate it. Once I get service, I'll go ahead and call y'all back. And, uh... happening over here yes oh, big breakfast yeah bacon potatoes eggs I'm gonna go cook up my eggs I forgot I got distracted <laughs> well you're the welcome bacon smells good though to eat some of ours but yes that. I'm getting harassed I keep forgetting to give people my stickers I got them I just keep forgiving to give them out Look at that, I found one of my stickers. Oh, wow. <laughs> Golly gee. Get it all put together. Sandy, want a Life of Trevor sticker? Absolutely. Thank you so yeah, much. Yeah. Appreciate it. You want a second one? Nope. <laughs> I didn't know one Carrie wanted one. You want one, baby? Yeah, get me one. Right. Yes, That's thank the second you. One. All right. All right. Free stickers. Thank you so much. You bet. You don't drink coffee? I don't. No. I don't. <laughs> really? Really? I love coffee. I drink it all day, every day. So I guess the first event has been a huge success. Well, I think it's been a huge success. Oop, I didn't finish my coffee. Granted, not a ton of people showed up, but I kind of like it. You know, when a lot of people are around, it makes it a little bit hard to get to know everybody. and. Here I am, I already remembered everybody's name, which is a really big compliment for me. Larry Stockman, also known as the man with the hat, AKA Hippie, is down here with his Jeep, and he brought a couple of his friends, actually. Um, a cool guy named Jerry, and his wife, Sandy, they got a really nice Rubicon, and they came down here, not exactly built for overlanding, but I mean, they went all basic, just tossed that air mattress in the back of their Jeep, took it camping, we're all here just having a good time. I'm making my coffee. I recently discovered that this coffee maker actually draws like 100 watts of power. Or not 100, like 800 watts of power. And so, if I wanna brew coffee, I gotta leave the Jeep running so it'll keep the battery charge. It really drains down on this. The plan though, soon, is to have a solar setup. I'm gonna have two solar panels on the top here I'm going to rig it so it'll hook up to the Jackery. That way it won't drain on the battery. I guess that thousand watt power inverter did come in handy. Now I get to make coffee. Oh, also, we haven't figured out what it is yet, but it, for a second we thought there was a forest fire over here. It's kind of more of a smog now, but there was a lot of smoke just coming from, from over here. Um, with the little reception we got, we weren't able to find any like fire warning alerts or anything, so we're assuming it's safe. Got real foggy around here though, it just looks like clouds. 
got real smoggy over there too. All the smoke just blowing that way. Ah, but for now we're still alive, so we're calling it safe. I have the full setup out here. I got my coffee maker, my coffee creamer, my computer, I'm getting ready to edit some videos. It's just a full setup. Awesome. Uh, my chair is a little low for how I'm sitting here, but uh, I'm trying to be a little quiet because everybody else is taking a nap right now. But I am just out here in the middle of nature. I got all my stuff. I got this right here. Right, this thingy here, I'm using that. I'm currently using that to charge my laptop. It was a little upgrade I added. All it is, is it's an extension cord that goes to the power inverter. That way I can just get direct power all the way up to this. I got my stimulus check in the mail, so I'm going to use that money wisely. I've been kind of thinking of a few things that I need. You know, I have to measure out things that I should buy now, things I should wait on, because there's a lot of stuff I think that would definitely help benefit me or definitely help benefit the channel. It's finding that balance. Right now, I really want to get to Colorado, so I need the gas money to get to Colorado. However, there are a couple other things that I think are really important that I need to get. For example, solar panels. Solar panels would save so much right now. Long term, it'll save money, in fact, and I probably won't destroy my battery as much as I've been pressuring it right now. Some stuff like that that I want to get to upgrade. I would really like to have money for a kayak or a paddle board really soon. There's, I need to get my windshield fixed. That's more of a mandatory thing. And you know, stuff like that. I'm trying to measure all that stuff out. I've been having a great time though at my little jamboree. I've been trying to think of what I'm going to call these from now on. And you know, being that this was the first one, it wasn't the most organized setup. But you know, after doing it, I really had a great time with it. And you know, trying to think of you know for future reference how I should go about this especially when we get into bigger states I really want to do something like this down in Colorado different things like that I think it'll be really exciting um, so as far as mine goes I was trying to think of a name for it and I think I got it now typically meetups like this were called jamborees and it was mostly dedicated to Jeeps I'm okay with pretty much anybody showing up honestly I don't really care if it's a Jeep a Toyota um, you know bring whatever anything you have I mean, bring your Honda Accord if you can get it up here let's go you know let's go out camping however I'm a pretty big fan of the name Jamboree I think it sounds pretty cool but I named my Jeep Bonita I was originally calling this the life of Trevor Jamboree and it just didn't have a ring to it I was trying to think of a cool name and I was trying to think what would a Jamboree be in Spanish so I came up with the perfect term guys so from now on we're calling these the Bonita Jamborees and that's what we're calling it. I'm super excited I think it's really funny Supposed to make sure this coffee is good enough for me. All right, well, let's check it out. <laughs> the percolator coffee. A dark, deep roast right there. Oh, yeah, straight. I did over cream it though. <laughs> a little more? A little more. Thank you. There's a spoon right here if you need it. Uh, it mixes with it. Thank you though. Okay. Got kind of like little bushes or whatnot, but. Yeah. <laughs> will it will it pass the test? It passed the test. All right. It works. You know what I'm Trevor test. I almost bought myself a percolator yesterday, but I was like, I need to get rid of one of these pots before I do that. I have too much stuff in it. You know what? It, it kind of looks like those pop-up targets. Yes, what I was thinking. That's what it looks like. <laughs> really? I First thought, I thought it was turkeys. With their... I could hit them from here if I had hippies rifle. Hmm. You have a legendary rifle? Hmm? You have a legendary rifle? I guess. Because he didn't just say a rifle, he said hippie's rifle. <laughs> <laughs> uh huh. Roy and Carol decided that we needed more drinks. You know, that Dr. Pepper, that good stuff. I'm allowed to do, drink Dr. Pepper. I'm, I'm hanging out with the, with the gang, so I'm allowing myself to drink Dr. Pepper. But they went down there. Just got back. Just before the sun went down, too. Yeah, the goat. <laughs> Look at that technique. Look at the skill. <laughs> it's gonna happen so fast, I'm gonna miss it. Yeah, he, he wants to record you. Oh. Oh, it's already set up. Never mind. Too late. <laughs> this is your shower. Oh wow! Look at how fancy it is.
some more. It's like instant. We need to put it over here so we can anchor it on the Jeep. <coughs> yeah. This ground is a little too rocky. It's the fastest I've ever put up. <laughs> yeah. And taken down. You ready? Yep. And then we'll open it up and y'all can take a grand tour. The grand tour. <laughs>